Welcome guys back to another Unreal Engine 4 tutorial. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create a level selection in your main menu. So the first thing you're going to want to do is get a screen new folder to store all your levels. I'll call this levels. And let's just add three levels. New world. New world one. Actually, no. This one. I'm going to just open it up. And let's just add like a basic landscape to it. Let's create the world. Let's add some light. And let's add a fog. Perfect. And then let's duplicate this two times. Now we have our three worlds that we're going to use. Now the next thing you're going to want to do is create another folder. Let's call this menu. And then create a widget, main menu, and then create another level, no. and call this main menu level. Open up your main menu. Let's just add three buttons 300 by 200. Um, just put that there. Let's copy it. Let's put that there, let's copy it, and then let's put that there. Okay, and now let's add some text to all of them. I'm going to call this level 1, level 2, level 3. There we go. And now open up your, oh wait, no, click on the levels and then do on click the three of them. On click and on click. And now I'm going to rename these buttons level one, level two, and level three. Okay, now in the graph, drag out and hit open level. And then over here in your level name, just get your level name. So for me, this will be levels, new world. Uh, let's copy this. Make this new world one. Let's copy this. And then over here, just make it new world two. There we go. And then the next thing we're gonna have to do is remove the widget. So then hit remove from parent. Let's copy that. Okay. And then uh, show mouse cursor. Set show mouse cursor to false. Um. As the target, get layer controller should work. We only need one player controller, but we need three of these. Okay, let's do that. Now plug them all in. And one more thing. So on the event construct, Set show mouse cursor to true. Oh wait, you still need a player controller. There we go. So now we have a very basic main menu set up. And... Okay. Now the next thing you're going to want to do is go to project settings. Maps and modes. Event startup mode. Main menu level. Game default level. Main menu level, this will make your main menu level start up at the beginning of the game. And then open up your main menu level. Go to blueprints, open level blueprint, event begin play, create widget, get your main menu, and then add to viewport, and set that as the return value. Okay. That should be all set. 
So now if we were to launch the game, level one would bring us to level, oh wait, I forgot to add a thingy over here. Yeah, there's no um, player start. So let's fix that. Just add a player start wherever you want. Because this is where the player is going to start. So now if we open up our main menu level again. Why are you fine? Oh. Um. I think it's just something wrong with the first level. Oh, I know why. I had another world called New World, and I was trying to open up the other one. Okay, so the first one isn't going to work because of that, but it should work for you guys. So then if I try the second level, it brings me to level 2. And then if I try the third level, it brings me to level 3. And that's the end of today's tutorial. Um, please subscribe for more videos, only if you want to see them. So bye.